What's up guys, it's Warren here from Blue Cloud Creation X and in today's video I'm basically going to show you how to import your PSB Photoshop files where you do your artwork and etc into your Unity project. So this is my Unity project, I just separated this uh, game and screen and the layout of my workspace. So the first thing I'm going to do to use Photo PS, Photoshop PSB files is I'm going to go into our package manager and then I'm going to look for this here. You can already see it's up to date, so it came with the 2D project. So if you create a new project in the um, Unity Hub, you will just have to choose 2D and then this should be imported with the project. So the first thing I'm going to do now is open up Photoshop. I'm going to create a new folder. Uh, this is 4K, 3840 by 260. I'm going to click Create. I'm going to click the new layer and I'm basically going to use our rectangular marquee tool and create a box and then I'm going to fill this box with this color, this orange color so we're going to click fill and that's fine and then we deselect Control D we'll go to save as save on our computer and then we look for large document PSB files. I'm going to call this box. You should usually do it in white so you can change colors in Photoshop and in Unity. But this is just for demo purposes. So I know I saved my project in users student and it's going to be test PSB. And then we can go into assets create a new folder and call this art and then we can save it here click OK it'll save, go back to Unity see it starts loading So once it's done importing, we'll be able to use it in our project. So if you click on Art, you'll see box here. This is just the instance of our Photoshop PSB file. We'll open up this and then we actually have our separate layers. So if you open up box and what you want to do is change the mesh type to full direct. And then if you open up our sprite editor, So you apply this full direct and then if you open up our sprite editor, we just want to see if we actually have these two files, our white background and our uh, orange box. So let's open up the sprite editor and then we see we have this as a sprite and we have our white background as a sprite. So what we can do is create a create an empty game object and we can actually add this as a sprite create a sprite renderer sprite renderer is basically a an image for a game object so we can drag our layer 1 which is actually our box and I don't think we renamed it here like if we actually make changes here save this Go back to Unity. I think it's just saving now. And doing its re import. So I'm just going to give it a few seconds. And we can see now onto that, click save. So I actually think my external hard drive I got disconnected, so but I'm just gonna show you quickly how we can move this into this. And now we actually have an instance of our box and any changes we make here will reflect 
in after saving you know photoshop file will reflect in unity but thanks guys for watching hit the subscribe button and the notification bell and you can also play my first game in the description and join me in my discord server or follow me on instagram thanks guys for watching cheers bye